And then I realized I have too much clothes. Too much clothes. Is it a bad problem? I don't know. Well, in this case it is because I need to pack a limited amount of clothes because I'm only gone for, for a little, well, I'm gone for like three weeks, but yeah, you feel me? Out of my, my scattered room right now because like I said, I'm packing, packing for a trip and obviously I have to break down to clean up. One thing I want to do though is that before I leave, I like, before I travel anywhere, I like to, I like to, I like to um, clean up my environment at least, at least so that I come back to a, to a clean space, you feel me? Um, I got this hat like two, I got this hat like two years ago, actually when I visited London and, well not London, but when I visited Birmingham and I went thrift shopping, there's a video as well, you guys can go back and watch that, but um, I got this hat a while ago and to be honest, I don't know why I got it, but it reminds me of, you know, Russian or like the Hitler times. One thing I do hope is that I hope this signal, this sign on here does not mean anything crazy because I'm not trying to be cancelled or anything, but I like it and I've just not found a way to wear it. But I think on this trip, I'm going to figure out different ways of, 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 of wearing stuff. So yeah, I think I'm going to take this one with me and see what we can do with it. You feel me? So now that we've cut down my closet of well, the things I've brought out to pack with me, I have to cut down even more and then condense it into this little box right here because everything has to go in this box because I'm taking the train and it's like a four hour train or five hour train. And I really don't want to be taking a whole huge suitcase. <sighs> Packing is really hard. Do you guys know that? Like, I feel like I wish like I was at the level where like I could just have um, an assistant. An assistant is just like, oh yeah, I'm just going to call him up. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So Mr. Benedict needs to travel. So you have to pick, figure out what he needs to get or even like to the point where like if I have you know those people that have make a lot of money and then when they travel to a place they travel literally with nothing and then they just buy everything they need to buy or like they have an assistant that buys all, all the things you know you know you know I feel like I'm I should be that kind of person you feel me but it's time it takes time you know you know what we always say on this channel is all about growth so we're taking time to get to that point I don't know I kind of want I want to take use this trip as a time to like you know reflect and um change well, not really changed, but like, I mean, you know, it's the new year, you know, the whole new year, new me. I don't really believe in that, but at least like, I believe in at the end of the year, you want to go, go away to a, to a nice place, you know, see some nice views, see a different, see different places and then reflect on yourself and figure out the things you need to do for the next year. Not like goals, but more like fixes, you know, um, fixes you need to make for the next year. This thing. gonna close this box you guys can see how packed it is already but i'm gonna close the box and i think i'm done oh wait oh let's not make that mistake guys for the guys on this channel anytime you travel make sure you never never ever forget underwear because <laughs> <laughs> you're going to you're going to be feeling so uncomfortable you're gonna to have to buy new ones when you get to wherever you go to but underwear is like so essential so we're gonna to have to pack that up but first box packed up ready to go um it's kind of heavy but it's good it's good it's good i can carry it so it's not, it's not bad so mission accomplished number one This is my outfit for tomorrow. Look at me putting my outfit out like I said, like as if it's the first day of my, my first day of school. You guys know when when we were kids and you had the first day of school, you put out your outfit and like basically patiently wait. The day before my birthday, my night before my birthday, I would always put out like a nice outfit. Like honestly, I wish I took videos when I was a kid because when I tell you guys like I was so much of a fashion killer as a kid that like little things would make me like want to dress up like i remember times in my primary school this is in nigeria i would like wear like i'll see i'll see something on tv like i used to watch a lot of mtv i'll see something from tv and like like these bogus jeans and like 
from New York, like these, all these big things. And I'll just tell my mom I want to get it, and she'll get it for me. And I'll wear it to school, wear it on my birthday. I remember the time when I was like, I can't remember how old I was, but like I remember I could see artists and people, and obviously my my older brother wear watches and like the watches that would dangle, the big one. And I I can't remember why I got this watch from at, at the time my mom. So my mom owns a charity shop like in Nigeria, like a thrift store. So like she, I remember someone got a charity shop and I sold like half my games to her so that she could sell it in a charity shop so I can get that watch. And I would like wear the watch every time and the, the watch was not working. I tell you, not working. But it was just because of the aesthetic, you know. Um, funny, funny story time. But I wish I had videos from when I was a kid. I was showing you guys a lot. But um, we're creating new memories now. That's what we're doing now that we're older, more now, now that we're older and that we're we're creating memories. I feel like you guys are chilling with me right now, honestly. While I'm packing up, She's keeping me company. I'm keeping you company. Whatever you're doing. I also want to take some glasses with me. So tell me, guys, you guys tell me, let me know what you think. I don't know. Honestly, these are like my last gold. I don't wear gold, by the way. I don't wear gold because I don't think it fits me. I don't think it fits my, my aesthetic. But I also want to take some glasses. Well, comment down below, what do you guys think about mixing up stuff? I also have this one that I could wear as well. Well, you guys have seen this a lot. I like this, like, my favorite glasses. I got that on Amazon. Amazon. Um, I literally just searched it. I remember, I can't remember what I remember seeing. I think I remember seeing one of my friends was wearing like one of these like colored shades and I asked them where they got them from. I can't remember what they said. And I know, I know where they told me what it was from was too expensive. So I was like, you know what? Amazon always has those deals. So I looked up on Amazon. Blue shit. Oh shit. I looked up on Amazon. Um, orange shade glasses. And guess what? These popped up. So I got them. And they were like, well, they ran me like what, 14 fourteen dollars, not nothing crazy. And the last accessory I'm gonna be taking, you guys know your boy loves watches, is my my watches right here. Um I only have like well, I only I only own four watches, but in with, with this my travel case, I can only carry three. So I have to pick out the three that I most frequently wear. Obviously, my first watch, you guys saw the video, my tag, my price possession my 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 my, my, my this is my joy because I, I bought it myself it's a big a big thing for myself uh for the price and then i have this watch which is a, a swatch um honestly i should stop wearing this watch but this is because there's a this story behind it is not too too good um and then this one which was given to me by my father when i was like about 14 or 13 or around that basically when i first turned, turned teenager my dad gave me this watch like basically saying that oh yeah you're a man now and this watch is actually older than me because he got it like early early in the 90s too so it was nice it's nice it's nice it's nice collection i feel like i have a, I have a good collection going on obviously like till we start to get into the rolexes till i start to make my money and you know we start to get some crazy pieces and i'll stop wearing these um so i'm going to take these as well with me with my glasses and yeah, I think there's all there's all there's gonna be all my accessories I'm gonna be taking with me. Like, guys, I'll let me bring you guys down a little bit. All right, so I'm all done with packing, and at this point of the video, I think I've kept you guys too long in my space. So I'm gonna kick you guys out now because I think we're done. Um, thank you guys for keeping me company on my pack. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video, which is tomorrow. So, um, yeah.